This 9v9 tactical game takes place over two thirds of the field. The red team play in a 3-2-3 and the yellow team play in a 4-3-1. The coach will focus on developing the yellow team's back four ability to build up and start the attack, with the emphasis on the center backs penetrating into midfield. The yellow team's back four starting positions have the left and right backs high and wide, and the two center backs with a good distance between them. The game begins with the yellow team moving the ball side to side, trying to find a player who can go forward. The coach steps in to make a few points regarding the movements of the players without the ball. He makes the point to the striker who received the ball that he should have allowed the center back with the ball to penetrate into the space he just checked into. He also explains to the center back without the ball that as soon as the center back with the ball moves into midfield, he has to move quickly to close the open space and stay connected. Notice here how the yellow team defender relieves pressure by playing back to the goalkeeper. The goalkeeper is able to strike an accurate driven ball to the left back making a good run into space. The left back does well to penetrate into open space for a shot at goal. At this point, the yellow center back is able to read the entry pass and intercept the ball. He makes a good decision to retain possession by noticing he can't go forward and turns back to switch the point of attack. The ball is switched to the other center back who is able to exploit the open space into midfield to take a shot on goal. Notice how upon transition the yellow forward and midfielders apply high pressure to try to win the ball back. Here the yellow team forces the ball out wide as the back four shifts over to be in good covering positions not giving the red team any good forward passing options. Eventually forcing a bad pass for an interception. Playing games with set formations helps players develop a tactical awareness of their responsibilities within their positions and gain a better understanding of making decisions that can translate to the 11v11 game. <laughs> 